What's up, girlie? Welcome to my weekend, I mean my weekly vlog, where I like to bring you guys along with me with just anything that I do. It's very random. But if you're new here, my name is Michael, and I am 24 years old. My favorite color is obviously pink, got a lot of that going on, and my favorite hobby is shopping. Right now, we're about to go thrifting, because I haven't been thrifting in a while. It'd be nice if I could, like, find some people's Christmas presents, and, you know, obviously a lot of stuff for me. I'm sure they got, like, pink, or I'm hoping pink. I'm sure they got a lot of Christmas decorations out, so... I'm just really interested to go see what they have and let me show you the fit of the day. Here's the outfit I got going on. It's another one from Victoria's Secret, but this is the brown set. It looks really cute with the shoes that I got on and I'm going to be using that juicy bag again that I just posted. I just posted a YouTube video. It's actually not posted yet. Let's go check on it. Okay, so my video is almost posted. As you can see, like the SD is complete, but it takes a while for it to be HD and I don't let it fully post until it's HD. Try to make sure you're seeing the best of the best. And also, if you're new here, I'm definitely way bigger on TikTok than I I'm on YouTube. I'm just not getting started, but I did hit 20,000 subscribers on YouTube recently. So thank you so much. That is amazing. So right now I'm going thrifting and I'm going to film a TikTok while I'm thrifting, but I'm also going to YouTube with it and I'm going to be doing uh, two TikToks at the same time. So two TikToks and a YouTube video. It's going to be so much fun. And you're going to be seeing like all the behind the scenes if that's interesting to you. Kind of interesting to me. I use, I grew up watching YouTube videos like just like this, like people's daily vlogs and they were just very random and very comforting to watch. So I hope it's the same for you. Of course I'm getting my Dunkin' real quick. It went so fast the ordering that I didn't even get a chance to turn on my camera till just now but how's my hair look I'm using a new hairspray so I got my normal just ice mocha peppermint latte the signature latte I got a medium like staring at them whenever they're making the drink like I'm not rushing you I'm just bored I'd rather watch you than the traffic I'm gonna do Apple Pay thank you I don't need it. Thanks. You too. I love when they offer to throw away the receipt because like for real, I don't need it, you know? Make sure no one's coming that way. Come this way. I need to finish my little TikTok clip real quick. Let's see if I can do that at, at this little stuff right here. Just film a little clip of me um, put my drink in the car. Okay, maybe that clip was cute. Maybe you can't notice the big mess in my car. Right, there's no cars coming, all clear. Oh, fuck. I need to look up the way to the um, Peddler's Mall from here. Mm, I don't want to go to that one. Mm, I don't want to go to that one. Mm, I don't want to go to that one. Fuck, where do I go? Oh my god, these cars are going to start honking at me if I don't get to move on. This is the one, this is the one. Okay, go. Do I go north or south? Okay, neither. Go straight. Do you hear all that? <laughs> Some car just like went around me too fast. Okay. Probably because I'm coming up on the highways. I didn't know which way it needs to go, okay? I put this thing down again like a sunburn. Also, I'm gonna go focus on my driving. Right, we're at the Pilers Mall. I'm gonna start my TikToks and I'll see you whenever I get in there. I don't know how this is gonna work. We're doing like two TikToks and YouTube at the same time, but we'll just set up the camera and we'll see. What's up, girl? It's the next day. I just left work. It's kind of been a weird day. I was going to vlog on my 30, but then I was just uh, not in the mood because, you know, work. But, um, what happened yesterday? So, yesterday. I was vlogging at the Peddler's Mall and my camera died. So I just went home and I started to ch charge the battery. And I was like, you know what? I'll just continue this vlog later. Oh my gosh, the freaking, can't do that. I was like, I'll finish this vlog later. But um, I never did that. I basically just posted a bunch of TikToks yesterday and then I, Then I played Minecraft for a while. I want to show you guys my Minecraft world. So I've been playing Minecraft a lot lately and I'm like back in my Minecraft era. I played Minecraft whenever I was like 13 until I was like literally 18. But I've just been having fun relaxing and playing and building on Minecraft with my online friends lately. 
not sure I like this lighting, so let's continue this video when I get home. I have a drive through code. It's 0164. What's up? What do you need? I just want to get a 10-piece chicken nugget with barbecue sauce. Okay, what's that? And a large sweet tea and a large Coke and a small fry. One moment, please. I said one moment. This bitch is rude. Okay, can you repeat? So the 10-piece nugget with barbecue sauce. Uh-huh. A large sweet tea. Large sweet tea. A large Coke. Uh-huh. And a small fry. Oh, I How are you guys? Okay. Is that it? Alright, I'm gonna go. I guess that's it because the screen said order complete. It's just fucking rude. Okay, did y'all hear her say wait a minute? Because I did not. But hold up. Y'all, it's the next day, I swear. My life, I'm going through like midlife crisis right now. It's got everything to do with my job. Not really ready to talk about it right now, but a little bit stressed. And this McDonald's girl is not about to make it better. Let me use Apple Pay. to be my crumpled up receipt. Don't catch the Mick attitude with me. Like, I'm already not in the mood. Hello. Thank you. Thanks. I only came here to McDonald's because, I mean, I know everyone's canceling everything, but... My coworker wanted a Coke, so I got her a Coke. Anyways, that's your sign not to go to McDonald's. Shouldn't have even went there in the first place. Freaking, let's see how rolling down this window. Ugh, I hate everyone right now. I just, I can't wait to go home. Okay, I know I look crazy. I just woke up and I was literally popping some pimples in the bathroom and my power just went out. I literally like walked out the bathroom like finally done. Was gonna come out my room and it just started flashing and now my power's out so like the fish tank's not going. I don't know why it's out but I just texted my mom and I'm like <sighs> I was really looking forward to waking up on Saturday morning and starting over the week with like a new mood but oh my gosh what is going on? Why is my power out? Everyone's power has to be out. It can't just be mine, but I don't know why it's out. It's not storming. My power came back on, but the filter and the fish tank is still not on, so I'm under here, and I've, like, unplugged it and plugged it back in several times, and it looks gross. I don't even want to show it, but... Ugh. Why is the filter not working? Uh, I've already done some Google searches, and they can go, like, two to three days without the filter being on, and... I've actually had these fish go over 24 hours without the filter being on before because of the power being out. Hey, I got it. I just needed to shake it around a bit. I definitely need to fill it and like clean it out, but oh my gosh. I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna stop stressing. I need to stop stressing so much. Literally, look at these pimples. What's up, girlies? It's a little bit later. I feel a lot better. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna include, but it's been a rough week. I just tried to go get an oil change, but the line was really long. I sat in it for a while. But then I was thinking about how if a car pulled up behind me, I'd be stuck. And I've already been sitting there for like 15 minutes and just not moved. And it's supposed to be like one of those 10 minute oil change deals. So I expected the line to move a little bit quicker. But coming on a Saturday just wasn't the move because obviously it's going to be busy. But I really want to go check out the Bath & Wild Body Work $10 candles. So priorities. Check it out the candles. And then um, there's a Ross nearby and a Marshalls. So I'll probably go to both because I need to get some more Christmas gifts. I started to put my Christmas together I kind of want to show you like just a little bit without showing you all the gifts because some of those people might be watching this video but um whenever I get home I'll show you I started putting the gifts together but I have like some people who I'm done shopping for and then some people who have gotten nothing for so I still gotta keep going I'm 23 minutes away from the Ross and the Bath and Body Works and the Marshalls and uh, yeah, I really do need an oil change. I haven't gotten an oil change since I got this car in April. 
but it's just not in the cards for today so maybe I can if it's open tomorrow maybe I can try again tomorrow or I can it might even be less busy if I go one day after work because I get off work at a good time so I just gotta get back in the groove of things you could not tell from like my TikTok or Instagram or Facebook that anything has been wrong you know that I've had a rough week besides me telling people on TikTok I've had a rough week but my posting is so regular it's just like with YouTube you can tell something is up because oh my god I started this vlog on Tuesday and now it's a Saturday and I don't even know how long this vlog is the longest day was probably Tuesday because I remember I was out shopping but then my camera died and then it, it's just hard to vlog while I'm working and I got a lot on my mind a lot that I don't know if I'm ready to talk about, but I probably should. I'm just like a bumping and a bruising and a cruising. Yeah, I said screw that oil change. Uh, let's go shopping instead. The oil change will always be there, but the $10 candles in tomorrow. And for all I know, some good ones are already sold out. Okay, my speedy, move it. Eventually, you gotta let somebody over with a baby in the back. Side eye. I'm wearing the uh, Makeup P. Louise highlight. Do you guys like it? It's like blue. I really like it. Damn, this car did not just try to whip around me. We're going in the same turning lane, so you could try it with someone else. That was like really aggressive for no reason. keeping my eye on you they are so busy i just put up i could like hardly find parking not really the bath and body works but like the ross marshalls this whole area so annoying how it gets so busy around the holidays like y'all i like to shop year round it's usually not this crazy on a random saturday i'm gonna start a tiktok let's go get some ten dollar candles and i'm just gonna come back later with the haul because you know i'm not vlogging in there right now but um I need to start vlogging throughout the week. I tried it and it was just a mess. Oh, I just got done shopping. I definitely spent way too much, but most of it was Christmas gifts. Most of it. <laughs> I didn't play for that, but most of it was Christmas gifts. But um, I'll show you a little haul of all the stuff I bought for me whenever we get home. But I saw Belurged at Bath & Body Works and at Ross. And I got a little bit of Marshalls. I found a really cute purse at Marshalls. So I'm excited to show you everything that I got. I'm literally starving. I'm going to have leftover chili for dinner. So I'm like looking forward to going home, posting my TikToks and eating dinner. Some girl recognized me in the checkout line at um, Marshalls, one of the workers. She was like, are you Michael Duvall? I was like, oh my gosh, yes. I felt myself get red because it was so hot in there. But then whenever I walked out to my car, another girl recognized me and her boyfriend was just like, are you a TikToker? Cause she was shy and I was like, yeah. And so then she wanted to take a picture. So we took a picture and I wasn't as red or hot then cause we were outside. So I had a chance to cool down, but I'm going to focus on my driving. I can't wait to go home and eat. Maybe I should make, I usually make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches with my chili, but I'm thinking of doing grilled cheese tonight if I have the energy and stand and make the grilled cheese. This person just ashed like it looked like a blunt, but it wasn't a blunt. <laughs> they, they ashed something at the window. <gasps> What's up, really? I literally just got in the door and I want to show you everything that I bought. Well, maybe most things. I'm not really going to talk too much about the Christmas gifts because I don't want anyone who might be receiving some watch this and be like, oh, that's for me and the whole surprise is ruined. I kind of post what I buy on TikTok knowing that they might see it, but they might not know it's for them. And if I'm posting it now, they might already forget by Christmas, but you know I post it on my shopping. Oh my gosh, where do we start? So let's just start with this little, um, this is one of those soap holders. So I got two of these soaps and this one's really cute. Like the soap itself, so it really doesn't need a holder. I got this holder for whenever I have soaps that are like a good scent, but maybe not a cute color, you know what I mean? Even though this one's a cute color too, but I just kind of wanted it, it was bedazzled. I saw Zayna, which is a TikToker and a YouTuber that I like to watch. She had gotten the candle holder. Hang on, let me show you. She had gotten one like this, kind of like I have, and she said it's really good for like those scents that are good, but not like a cute packaging, so you can like put it in there, and I thought that was so smart. Like she was a genius for that idea, but let me show you what else I got. I got this peppermint, twisted peppermint hand sanitizer spray. I got the little gel version too, but I didn't see the spray whenever I went on Black Friday, so I had to get that. I got these little gummy things for two of my friends. 
I got some lotions for two of my friends. And then I just got a bunch of candles from there. I got five candles. It was $10 candle day. So this one's for a friend and it smells really yummy. This one's for this one's for me, White Gardenia, which reminds me of like the Barbie movie where they would call like what was it? They would call something Gardenia. It smells so good too. Like wild. It smells like wild flowers, which is like my favorite smell. This one I literally could smell in the car the whole way. It's called Paris Cafe. And it's like a really strong um, coffee. It's like you're walking into a coffee shop. I got this one from one of my friends. This is Champagne Toast. I already have it. You know, it's a classic. And then I got this one for me, I believe. I thought I got two of these. Did I just get one of these? For some reason, I thought I got two of these. So I think this is for me. I don't think it's a Christmas gift. I think this is going to be for me, but... That was everything from Bath & Body Works. In case you're wondering what I spent there, it was $121, which really isn't a whole lot. I got five candles, two soaps, and a bunch of little accessories. Let's go with Ross next because I found some good stuff at Ross and I'm not going to say who these gifts are for but it's like kind of obvious if you know the people in my life. So this one, it's a little Christmas story, just cup, not getting into too much depth because of who it's for. This one's just a little Harry Potter cup I got for someone. I got some little candy for some of my friends. I got this is for me, a Sasuke statue, which is so nice that they have these little statues at the stores right now. Didn't I mention in my last video? I feel like they're doing that because it's like Christmas season, so they're having like just tons of stuff come to the store, and these little statues are usually worth at least like $25, $30, but $14.99, little Sasuke. I also got this for me just because it was a good deal. It was $22, $22.99, and I've never tried this perfume before. I can't even really think of what it smells like. And then it comes with a little body spray, so I'm just always trying to get new perfumes. I want a really big perfume collection because I go through perfumes. Like, half of mine are, like, over halfway empty. Another bag from Ross. I have gotten this for myself. It says Busy Bee. It's a little notebook, but look how cute the little bee is, like, bedazzled. So I just had to get it. This is what it looks like. It has like gold edges, but it's just like, um, just looks like a calendar, you know? So I really like that. Oh, that looks a bit different. Okay, so it's got like this type of calendar in the front. Then I guess it's got like more intrigue, more, more detailed days, just stuff like that. So I got that for me and I got a similar one. It also says Busy Bee, but it doesn't have the cute little thing. But it's a little bit bigger. And I got this for someone else who I'm always buying those types of journals for. I got this for one of my sister's husbands, and then I got this for someone else in my family. This cologne just smells really good. I bought this for myself. It's a little bit too manly for me, but I love this scent, and I've never tried this, and I'm tempted to smell it real quick before I give it away as a gift, because I've never even opened this or smelled it. Let's do a little sniff real fast. Mmm. This smells very, very good. I don't know if it's just because I'm thinking of this one, but it seems like it might be very similar to the Nautica one. But I'm going to put this back because this is a gift for somebody, not for me. What else did I get? This is a gift for somebody, a little Paris Hilton Q-tip. Cat, stop it. I got this Just Do It water bottle, and I might give this as a gift for someone, but honestly, this would be so cute for me, like a little Nike water bottle, but I'll probably give it away as a gift. And then this is another gift, just a little, like, PlayStation water bottle. Oh, and I had, these are gifts too, these little Pokemon. Next up at Marshalls, I didn't find a whole lot at Marshalls, but I did find this super cute purse. Skinny Dip, I guess, is the brand of it. I don't know, but it says Barbie, and it's fuzzy, little tote bag, like it has these little handles. Isn't this just so cute? And it was $30, which, which is a little pricey for a small purse like this. I usually don't spend $30 on a bag like this unless I really want it. And it's not even silver chain, which you know I like. It's gold chain, but it was Barbie, fuzzy pink. Like, I felt like I had to get it. Definitely going to end up using this eventually. Even if I just take off the chain, I just like it like how it is as a little bag. I also got this for someone. I thought this was a cute little gift. It's just like an old Game Boy watch, so they're going like that. And then I got two more gifts, and they're both the same thing, but slightly different. This is like the Akatsuki Naruto mug with the socks, and this is just like Naruto little Uzumaki symbols on the socks and everything, and that's everything that I bought today, so most of that is Christmas gifts, and 
some of it is for me, especially like those candles. I can't help myself. Those candles are so nice. They're just so strong. Bath and Body Works candles, they burn so fast and they get so sooty, sooty, what's that stuff called? But they're really strong and that's why I like them. Cat, back up. She's trying to mess up my Barbie purse, but I'm going to put all this away. Let me just show you real fast and... Well, I'm going to put it away and then I'll show you. Oh, I'm hot, but this is everything that I got going on so far. So these are all Christmas bags for the people that I love. But I still need a couple more bags because here is just a bag full of gifts that I don't have bags for yet. Without getting into too much detail, I'm not going to say who's for what in case they're watching. But I got a lot going on. Some people are already done for and some people just need like a couple more things. Here's everything I bought for myself today though. These candles smell freaking amazing, so I have no regrets. I got myself some stuff. Let's see what this smells like. We're just gonna sit right here and smell it real fast. Cat, quit tearing up my floor. Oops. <laughs> Dropping everything. This packaging is so cute, so I hope it smells really good. I'm pretty sure I smelled it in stores. I just don't remember. Mmm. Smells really good. I actually really, really like that scent. I don't know why I'm spraying it on this outfit. I'm about to take this outfit off. So I should maybe spray some of my PJs. Let's try the body spray. Smells pretty much the exact same, but I'm sure it's like a lot lighter, whereas the perfume is going to last you a lot longer. I just wanted to show you that I was like putting a bunch of gifts together for people. I wish I could show you everything in the bag, but I don't want to completely spoil everything. I might do a little TikTok showing everything or something whenever it comes Christmas Day, but who knows, because it's really a lot. <laughs> Let's try out this little hand spray real fast. Mm, smells so good. I love spray sanitizers. I don't know why they feel so much cleaner than just using the little gel one, but let me go post my TikToks and then I'm gonna get some dinner going. I don't know when I'll see you next. You know, I get really bad. Like, as the sun goes down, I get really unmotivated. I cannot wait until the summer. This winter is killing me. It's not even winter yet. It's like fall still. Real fast, we are gonna put together my um, Sasuke statue because I was like, you know what? I need to put it away anyway. So let's just, while I'm still sitting here, let's just do it. You can see what he looks like. Ugh, I hate when there's tape all around these things. Here's how he comes. Oh, he comes with two separate arms. So he can either be doing the Chidori or he can just be reaching out. Obviously, he's going to be using his freaking chakra. There we go. Look at him. Pretty cute. I like it. I like the way he's like up in the air, not just like a standing statue. What's up, really? It's the next day. Well, this is not a good update. So if you follow me on my Facebook, I made a whole post about it. Or if you follow my Facebook or Instagram, I put it in my stories. But I threw up like eight times last night and it was kind of insane and a little traumatizing. But, um... It came out of nowhere. I went to bed just fine. And I woke up at 2 a.m. and threw up for the first time. And whenever I threw up, I started noticing these little dots, like, all around my face. Do you see that? Get real close and personal. That one's a pimple. But the rest are not, like, all that. And then there's more up here on my forehead. And then my eyelids. Hi, cat. Hi, kitty cat. But, um, I threw up. The first time and those dots appeared and that's never happened before and so I threw up seven more times after that like literally trying to go back to sleep and at a certain point I wasn't even like throwing up food anymore and I was like why am I still throwing up and I was just really really weak oh my god I was just really weak this morning I went ahead and called in work for tomorrow I can't believe I threw up that many times and I, like, on the very last one, I almost passed out. Like, that's how hard I was throwing up. But it's definitely not cute. I haven't even showered all day. Like, you can probably see that. But, um, I did order some groceries on Instacart. So, I'm about to make, like, some chicken broth, I guess. I don't really know how to make it. I did just post a TikTok about, like, the, um, stuff I've Instacarted. And, like, my head kind of hurts, but... Ooh, it hurt really bad for a second. It's just not a cute look, but, um... Here's the chicken broth I had picked up. I'm not sure how to cook it, but I think I'm just going to put some of it in a pot and heat it up and just drink it, you know? Maybe eat some crackers with it. 
just realized I'm not even like aimed at it. I'd also gotten this because I thought that might be yummy. And then all these like bay leaves and stuff. But I think I was just being extra. My fridge and my freezer is a mess right now. So this morning I had Instacarted and I had gotten just like ice. And I had gotten this, um, these little ice things because I was Googling stuff like good for you. If you're sick, you know, and it was like ice, even popsicles, like it said um, applesauce. I'm not pointed at it. It says applesauce. It said um, watermelon, apple slices, apple juice, these things. So I literally got everything. I've already drank almost a whole one of these, but I mean, it's been all day. I try to look at my watch, but it's not on. It's like six o'clock right now. But, um, yeah some good news i got a new tripod look how cute this tripod is and it's like really convenient to like travel with i'm gonna figure out how to make my broth and i really distracted myself all day by online or skyping or discording i mean playing minecraft online with my online friends so many just words jumbled but whenever i'm up doing too much i start to get nauseous again so i hope that it's just kind of done with I hope that it's just kind of done with and that I don't like feel sick from here on out and hopefully tomorrow like all these red dots and stuff will be gone. Cause I literally look like a zombie. It's not fun. I'm probably going to try to shower after I eat too because I definitely smell a little. But I haven't done like nothing all day. I literally just filmed like my Instacart order and that was it. That's all I've done today. I reposted my last week Sunday reset just with like different editing and a different song just to give me something to post but then I was like oh wait why don't I just use the Instacart but either way it's fun to edit and like put the songs together and all the captions and stuff I'm gonna figure out what to eat and how to eat and see ya see ya good morning girly it's the next day my hair still might be a little bit crazy I just got out of the shower and sorry if the brows were a bold choice but I decided just to do my brows because if I did like mascara, I'd have to rub my eyes a whole lot to wash it off, and I didn't want to do that because I still have like, let's see, can you see it? Yeah, you can definitely see it. I still have these spots all over my eyes, and scary update. I noticed whenever you pull my eyelids down, I don't even want to show you because it's like trigger warnings actually scary. It is bloodshot red. Like everywhere you can see is white, but everywhere else is like bloodshot red, especially on the bottoms and especially on this side. You can probably tell it's a little bit red just like underneath, but. I had a good night's sleep, so that made me really, really happy, and I woke up feeling fine. The only thing is, my throat still really, really hurts, and I haven't taken my temperature yet, but as long as I don't have a fever, I think I'm good to go to work tomorrow, and I'll probably end this vlog today, too, just so I can start with a fresh new vlog, but I looked up, and these vessels, like blood, popped blood vessels, could take up to two weeks to disappear, so hopefully it doesn't take that long. You can do stuff like cold press or like natural home remedy remedies, but it said like one to two weeks overall for it to go away. So I'm not going to go to the ER, even though I don't know if I told you I was thinking about it. But now that I feel a lot better and it's just like the red spots and obviously a sore throat because I threw up eight times. But um, this is the look that we're working with today. I'm probably not going to go nowhere except the drive through liquor store to grab some Rillos, but um, I'm about to make some breakfast. I'm going to do a little TikTok of me making breakfast, and I'll do a little voiceover and kind of tell them, because I didn't really tell TikTok anything about what was going on with me. I just told them, like, I got sick a lot, and now I got popped blood vessels, so I look a little funny, but I'll get to finally tell them, like, how I got to tell you. I feel like this might have been, like, the worst vlog ever. Like, did anything happen? I don't... I don't know. I think I had a breakdown for like three days in a row or a, the whole last week and then I had like one good Saturday and then I like, <laughs> I don't know. But um, I'm going to chill for just a minute before I make my breakfast because I just finished getting ready. So let's go do that and then I'll show you what I'm eating because I know you're so curious. I don't know what I'm going to make yet. I was either going to do turkey bacon and then make like eggs in a basket. That was it's called whenever you put it in the bread. I thought that would be fun and like new to do. But I might just do like grilled cheese with tomato soup because it's kind of lunchtime. And I've done a lot of turkey bacon like videos on TikTok. Like a lot, like my last like three or four cooking videos have involved turkey bacon. Like I'm on a turkey bacon kick right now. It's just so easy to cook and it goes so good with everything. But let's get this day started. You can probably tell by my attitude that I feel a lot better than yesterday. So that's a good thing. What's up, girly? It is two days later. I um, obviously feel better. I'm wearing makeup now. The only problem is like my eyes. So if I look up. You can probably see it. I don't know because I obviously can't look at my eye on the camera and everything at the same time. But hopefully it doesn't scare you. That eye is also like a little bit yellow still. Just like, I don't know, from the blood vessels bursting. But um, 
yeah, still going through my midlife crisis. I just kind of want to end this vlog here so we can start fresh. I really don't know what this vlog was. Hopefully it's not a total flop. I just got through opening up a box from my bestie Dom online. I was going to say on TikTok, but she's on, she's everywhere. She needs to get on YouTube uh, if you're watching this Dom, but um, she sent me so many goodies. So she makes these and she sent me those and then she also bedazzled this and she sent it to me. She sent me so much stuff. This little trash can, that little lotion set. She did not send me that. <laughs> um, Barbie like gummies. I'm excited to like try those and just like keep this jar and display it. But um, some Barbie stuff, like tons of Barbie stuff, tons of cute stuff. These glasses which like scream Playgirl Dom. And then, um, this plate, like, she had to thrift this. Look how cute that is. Just so much cute stuff, like, some of my favorite scents. I just wanted to hop on here and end this vlog so that I can get to editing it tonight and hopefully post it tomorrow. Tomorrow will be Thursday. Hopefully I can come to, um, my, I, I can come to a happiness with my midlife crisis. I don't know. I'm not ready to talk about it, and it's just... It's one of those things that you don't want to talk about until it's done and you feel more secure about it, you know what I mean? But no matter how this vlog turns out, I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you had fun just hanging out with me and I always have fun hanging out with you in the next, next vlog. I will try to have my life a little bit more put together, but I have no promises. I don't know what I'm doing with my hand. I'm just, I need to end this. Anyways, I hope that you subscribed. There's an airplane, kind of rude. I hope that you like, I hope you leave a comment. I love responding to comments. If you haven't already, ring the notification bell. I got I got to say this every week that my posting is random. I don't have a schedule yet and I don't know. I want to do like kind of maybe weekly vlogs but also post more than once a week. Like what do you think about daily vlogs? Just let me know what you think and I'm going to end the video here and I'll see you next time. Bye girly!